That's the back door, so we're not going that way. Let's see what we can find around here. Does this even work? Nothing. Of course not. Off. That would have been too good if that were a hey, microwave. No power. Okay, so we don't have any water. We don't have any power. Yeah. That's just awesome, isn't it? Got dog food. Yeah, I'm not eating that, but you got dog food. Hope we never get desperate enough for food that this starts looking appetizing. Never say never, man. You never know. I'm not that hungry. Besides, I need to finish checking the downstairs. Oh, that'd be funny. All right, what we got over here? Hey, we got a clock. It's one of those old ones. Expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. Indeed. Well, it looks like there's nothing more over here. Okay, here's the other people. Uh, we can check this room last because there's people in here, so we'll go over here. I'm guessing upstairs would be where we go after we find whatever. Yeah, let's have a look around here for now. There's a door here. Jesus! <laughs> Freaking brooms. What happened? It's nothing. Just nothing. Is that all there was in there? A broom, really? Wow, that's disappointing. Right, let's see what these guys got to say. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, but I'll take care of it. Hey, Guy. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far, so good. How's that couch treating you, Omi? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. They feel you. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. Well, we only got one more door by looks of things to explore down here. So, oh, a painting. Oh, two doors. Ah, <coughs> uh, sorry about that. My style. Uh, who are these people? Even the dogs in the family photo, man. It must have been one special dog, but it's understandable. My old cat used to be quite special as well. Alright, let's see. I'm sure there's something behind one of these doors. All clear in here. Alright. One more door. Just one more to check. Uh there's gonna be something behind here, isn't there? I just have that feeling. Uh, this is gonna scare crap out of me, I'm sure. Oh, it's just a bathroom. That's the last room. Looks like downstairs is secure. Awesome. Uh, place ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. No problem. Just hope Omid gets okay? better. Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? No, just some dog food. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell her. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Lee? 
You need to get up here now. Oh, What's wrong? Crap. It's Kenny. Yeah. Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. Oh, this is gonna be bad, isn't it? Stay here. Addicts are never good. Never. Hate the addicts. They're dark. They're scary. Ghosts live up there. I don't care what anyone says. Ghosts exist, man. Ghosts do, do exist. Kenny. Kenny. What's wrong, Kenny? Kenny, you okay, man? Oh, Jesus! What the hell is that? Oh my God! What the? What the fuck? What the hell did they do to their don't son? Like duck, don't he? It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out of here. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can leave. I couldn't do it before. I can't do it now. You sure? I guess we'll find out. Not like we have a choice. I can't let Kenny do it. Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. Oh, this could have been clear time if I hadn't found it when I did. Yeah, that's a scary thought. Yeah, I guess we gotta take him out. How many more kids are we gonna have to kill that's been zombified? That's just horrible. We should bury him. Yeah, Kenny's right. I'll take care of it. God damn it. Poor Kenny, man. He already lost his son, and now he finds another kid looking just like him that's already dead. Second kid we had to kill. Because of this frickin' the frickin' zombie plague. Might as well bury him with his dog. Poor kid. I don't know what to say in this moment, it's kind of a sad moment, even though we didn't know this kid, it's still sad, you know? Oh, we actually have to dig for ourselves. It's gonna be the first burial we ever had in this game, I think. Probably not going to be the last. <laughs> God damn it. Almost. To 
just one more should do it. Whoa! Who the fuck was that? Hey! Hey! You stay the hell away from us, you hear? Lee, what's going on? I saw someone standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't get a good enough look. What does it matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. Jimmy? I'm fine. I'm just... I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Me either. Walkers are one thing. But the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. I'm with Kenny. The sooner we get the hell out of here, the better. Well, then, hell, what are we waiting for? I'll go get my stuff. No, Ben, you'll only slow us down. Lee and I can go scout the river while the rest of you get ready to move out. You stay behind with Krista and Omid. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Clem, honey. I think it'd be best if you stayed here with Ben. I need you to watch out for Omid and Krista. Help them get ready to move out. Yes. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I know. It, it's just this once. Sometimes we all have to put aside what we want for the good of the group. Hey, don't worry. I'll be back before you know it, okay? Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Yeah, because I don't like you. You're a dick. That's not how it is, Ben. I need you to stay here and keep an eye on Clementine. I can do that. Well, just so we're clear. While I'm gone, anything or anyone tries to get inside this house, you shoot him. Don't even think twice about it. Understand? I got no problem shooting walkers. Did you hear what I said? Anything or anyone. Good. No, yeah, I can't have a freak coming back. That guy looked extremely weird too. That was freaking creepy. He was just standing there. That was fucking creepy as hell. Infected. Whoa, they even put up a sign over this town. Holy crap. It's freaking creepy, man.